First of all, Mr Knox, your reaction to this decision by the judge a few moments ago uh, not to question this independent witness uh, decision on the, on the DNA? Well, I think the, uh, what, that, what that tells me is the appeals court asked for the independent review and they came back with a very precise, accurate report. And I think what that does is it really says that they believe in that and there's no reason to do another review by the prosecution who were originally against you know, an independent review to start because with. Because these independent experts basically say that the DNA evidence that was used to convict your daughter and Raffaella and Solicito is unreliable. That's exactly what it says. And it, it, it basically, they have no case. There is no case left. And, and I'm very hopeful that by the end of the month we'll get to bring Amanda home. Do, 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 you think, do you think that what we're witnessing now is the prosecution case, which you were always obviously standing against, is now falling apart at the seams? Well, if you take a look at each of the components of the evidence and you eliminate the bra and the knife and anybody that knew about, you know, with their whereabouts, you know, that says that they didn't know it, there is no case. There is none. I mean, Amanda and Raphael were not at the house when Meredith lost her life. How optimistic are you, though, given your experience of the Italian justice system, of, the, of what you've been through in, the, in, that, in that trial that convicted Amanda of this killing? Mm -hmm. How optimistic are you really now that, that this evidence is going to feed into that process and you're going to see your daughter walk free? You know, I've watched the appeals court uh, act very differently during this trial. It, it really appears to me that they want to find the truth. And, you know, I'm, I'm very hopeful, you know, now, even after, you know, the response that we just received, that, you know, by the end of the month, we'll get to bring Amanda and, and Raphael home. All right. Okay. Kurt Knox, thank you very much That's for being my with pleasure. us. Thank you very much. Well, there you have it. Um, Kurt Knox, the father of Amanda Knox, expressing his optimism that his daughter will soon be released on the basis of what the court uh, decided today here in Perugia, Italy.